everybody. Once again, it's Mr. Raymond with this Monday motivational message. All right? Turn me up. Turn me up. Listen. You, right there. You, you, and you. Yeah. Oh, turn, turn it up now. Whatever device you're listening to, your phone, your laptop, your tablet, I need you to turn it up. This word that I'm about to share, oh my goodness. You need to hear this word. And listen, the word is so simple. Guess what it is, y'all? You're wondering now, right? Question marks, question marks. You're wondering now. The word is teamwork. Yes, we're in this pandemic. We all need to work together. We all need to wear our masks, stay six to eight feet apart from each other. Get your hand out your face. You remember that now, right? Listen, we all need to work together. So this word for this Monday motivational message is teamwork. What do you mean, Mr. Raymond, about teamwork? I know you may have a favorite football team. You may say you like the Cowboys, or you may like the Falcons, or you, you may have a favorite basketball team. You may like the Golden State Warriors. You may like the Lakers. You may like the 76ers. You know, uh, I'm a big Patriots fan, and all those teams need to have something in common. What do they have in common? They have players, right? And all those players must be on the same page. All those players must have teamwork. All those players must work together to obtain a common goal. And what is that common goal? To win, to win the game, to win, to win the game. Okay, so just like we all need to work together, just like we all should come together, play on the bigger scale of working together, listen, i tell you this. So it was one hot day at the beach, right? I, I was done with my swim. I began to walk to the car. You know, here in Virginia Beach, it's a long walk. Wherever you park it, I try to park for free. So it's a long walk. So I'm walking, minding my own business. I see this guy and like two little boys. The car, their car, y'all, had ran out of gas or did something. And they was mm, mm, pushing the car up this incline. All right, so mm, two voices popped in my head. They was like, Mr. Raymond, that's a great opportunity for you to help. Then the other voice say, oh, no, mind your business, keep walking. It's already hot, and it's time to go. But mm, I leaned over, walked towards them. I said, hey, sir. The man said, hey. I said, you need any help? So I put my back and my shoulder and my arms together, ready to push this car. Man, it was heavy. Man, it was a lot of work. But we started pushing, and the car and the car began to move. It began to move. i never forget it because the dad said, after we got the car where it needed to be, the dad said, sir, I want to thank you because your strength added with ours made this thing go. Made this thing go. Listen, are you that team player that will help your friends push to the next level? Are you that team player that will help? We all have struggles in life. But are you that team player that will put your ego aside and say, hey, I'm about to help my brother or my sister push. They really going through, and I know I have that extra strength as a team player to push, to push, to help each other. We all in this together. They say teamwork make the dream work. So are you that special team player that will look out for everyone else, that will help everyone else? So it was this man. There was this man. Uh, him and his guys and his friends went on a boat, and they went to go fishing, okay? And the man uh, felt something on the line. Uh, it was a big old fish. The fish was so huge that the fish made the man get out the boat like, oh my goodness, crushed it. He fell overboard into the water. The man that was in the water said, help me, save me, I can't swim. His friends tried to pull him by the arm, mm, but he had a fake arm, dang it. The, 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 the man in the water said, help me, save me, I can't swim. So the friends in the boat, took his leg and tried to pull him by his leg, but that was artificial limb. 
My goodness. So the man is going crazy in the water. Hey, help me, help me. I can't swim. And so the friend took his head and tried to pull him from his head, but the man hair fell off. The friends got upset. They say, what in the world? How you expect us to help you if you won't stick together? Okay, on this team, on this team, we all have to stick together. We all have that common goal, and that's to win. We all have that common goal, and that's to see this pandemic pass us by. We have to stick together. We have to wear our mask. We have to make sure we sit to eight feet apart. We have to stick together. Hey, we in this together. You know what? And your boys and girls club family are right here with you. We miss you here, but we got to stick together. And you know what? Going to school on the computer for nine weeks, y'all, I know it's going to be tough. But you can do it. You can make it. Teamwork make the dream work. And if you need help, don't hesitate to ask somebody. Because we in this together. Teamwork make the dream work. That was your Monday motivational message from me, Mr. Raymond. Hey, tune in tomorrow, the next day. We'd love to see you. Comment, like, share, do whatever. See ya. So for this week, you will see for our virtual programming, various of fun games that you can do at home. Um, so the first game we'll have is pick it up. But as the days go by, you'll see different games and see kids interacting and doing those games. And today's game is called pick it up. And what you need is plates, denomination of money, and some chopsticks. And the object is to get as much, a bigger amount of denomination of money and to the other plate on the other table so that you can win to beat your opponents. Thank you for tuning in. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye.